Hello guys. Welcome back. Welcome back to the channel. Hold on for a minute. Let me get my water. Oh. Yes, y'all. Good afternoon. Almost evening. Mm -mm. Sorry, guys. Good afternoon. Good afternoon to everybody. Happy, happy Friday to each and every one of you all over the world. Please come on in to the video. I am having my lunch. So let me tell you what I'm having today. We're going to get into a snip of a topic from yesterday topic. Thank you guys for letting my part two of the video reach 1K. Um, part one, um, it's doing okay, but part two really hit 1K. So I just want to come in and just talk to my yum yums and share my lunch with you. Always remember water on deck. Always the importance in your life. You have to have water, guys. It is very important. So let's get a little swig of this. I took my pressure pills already for breakfast this morning. I had an avocado on toast, a cup of coffee, and of course, a bottle of, a bottle of water. That's what I wanted. So now this afternoon, I'm having some sauté squash, peppers, spinach, onions, which I love, with a little bit of um, pepper on there, uh, just a drizzle of olive oil that I, that I sauteed it in, and just a pinch of salt. And I have some sauté, um, thin cut pork chop with no flour, just a little bit of garlic powder, uh, onion powder, pepper, and Mrs. Dash. So let's eat a little bit and then we're going to get into the topic, guys. You know who I'm talking about, guys. So let me be the first to give my yum yum something very, very healthy. As you know, guys, I try to eat healthy as possible. Um, so let's give you guys... A little bit of this um, spinach, squash. I love squash. Peppers, um, purple onions. They say they're red onions, but you know, that they're purple to me. And that's what I'm having for lunch. So here you are, yum yums. Have a taste. You like it? Okay, let's see. Let's see what it tastes like. Mmm. Mmm-hmm. Mm. That's good. Mm hmm. So, this is what I'm having for lunch today. Let me get a little more of me. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Here's a piece of. Thin cut pork chop with no flour. Mmm. Mmm. -hmm. Mmm. -hmm. Pretty good, guys. It's raining out today. Dreary day. I hate when it rains. All right, yum yums. Have another bite. Very healthy for you. Anastasia wants you to be healthy. Mmm. Mmm. The reason. Mmm. That Rita wool ice look good. <laughs> Why? I chose to try to eat healthy because I am borderline. And borderline by Vid. Um And they keep up with my AC1. And my AC1 has been very much so perfect at all times when I go to the doctor. So here's another piece. Um, I 
Mmm, so good. I want to continue to keep it that way. Oh, well, I forgot. And I have mushrooms in there. Sauté mushrooms in this uh, stir fry concoction I have here. Mmm. Mmm. That's good. So good. So let me drink a little bit of water. And then we're going to get into the topic. Now, I need to tell you guys that I needed to come back here because I wanted to speak about this uh, supposedly hair tutorial that uh, Adrian supposedly hooked on all of a sudden, guys. And the thing that got me, guys, is that she sat up there and she twitting a little, little four braids on one side, four braids, twisties on the other side with all that damn gray hair. With all that damn gray hair, but now you want to act like you want to do a hair tutorial. Now you act like you're so interested in doing your hair. When we all know that she's she's not interested in doing her hair at all. First and foremost, let me get this last bite. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. Guys, you got to try this. If you love squash and you love mushrooms and you love onions and you love spinach, start telling you some squash purple onions, spinach, mushrooms, and drizzle it in a little garlic and saute it. And it is so banging. It's so banging. And it's, it's very much healthy. The olive oil is healthy for you. Mm-hmm. Oh. I'm almost done, guys. I'm hungry. I'm hungry. Um... So all of a sudden she finds interest in doing a hair tutorial. First of all, guys, she's 50 years old. And who gets on here speaking about some damn edges? You know, she just got on here and actually made herself look like a, a complete idiot, like a complete fool. Mm-hmm. Because she has nothing to talk about. She has nothing to bring to the YouTube. She's boring as hell. She has no friends. That's why that girl Soul and the girl Lady, the little skinny girl, that lady that was in the car with her doing the, um, the mukbang once again with her in the car. Girl, Lady, you better do. You ain't learned yet, Lady. Mm, girl, mm. girl, I'm almost done. I'm just putting my mouth loop. Mm. Mm. If you ain't learned nothing yet from her, hmm, okay. You back at it again with her. Okay. I'm almost finished, yum yums. Oh, so good. Mmm. 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 Mm. All gone. That was popping. That was popping. So, getting back into the video. Mm. She gets on here, and all of a sudden, she wants to do a hair tutorial. First of all, Guys, she cheap as hell because if you wanted to get on here and you wanted to show out and show up, you want to show up and show out and you want to do something spectacular on YouTube and make it look interesting and make it look, you know, presentable, you would have went to a hair store like um, 
you know, Sally's to get the hair products and stuff like that. You know what I mean? Um, all right, guys. <laughs> Excuse me for a minute. I'm digging in my teeth. And I don't like to do that before the camera. That's so ignorant. And so, you want to get on here. You want to show up and show out. You know, like you're doing some, something tremendous. You know, something grandstand. You know, um, do do it the right way, honey. You did it all in the wrong perspective. You, you, you're you showing us dollar products, Adrian. Sorry, guys. I got to dig my teeth. I hate needing my teeth. Um, I should be done in a minute. Okay. Mm -hmm. You show us all dollar product. What was that bad something she, she had? Some kind of stuff she had that she put in her hair? First of all, you don't put a conditioner in your hair and you leave it in your hair. Now, unless it says it's called leave-in conditioner. Now, maybe that's what she had in her hair, leave-in conditioner. But, guys, you know that that damn Adrian, she is wicked as they come, honey. You know, all of a sudden, you're interested in doing a hair tutorial. Now, as I stated, this is part three of the video. You know that you have no interest in doing a hair tutorial. Well, one, the reason why you're doing it because you're trying to get back at Miss Beloved. Because Miss Beloved still, first and foremost, still not paying you any attention. Beloved is still not sending you no money. So you figure I'm going to shame her one more game. Mm. Well, let me tell you how you not shaming her. You shaming yourself. You sitting up there shaming yourself, showing your hair. Your damn head is full of gray hair, honey. And that little thing, that little, little, little scarf thing you had on your head. To keep your edges down or whatever, because you know you you got you have some dynamite edges as you proclaim and you think you have, but you got all that damn gray hair. Girl, go get you some Clairoy. Get you some hair dye. Oh, wait a minute, don't get no hair dye because see, you're thinking that you the shishness. Now, if you go get some hair dye and you put the dye in your hair, your damn hair gonna turn yellow. <laughs> You know what I mean? That's how karma will come back to bite you. That's the only reason why you probably won't put that Clairoy, Clairol, or any type of dye in your hair. And first and foremost, it causes cancer. Um, and first and foremost, it, um, the, the perm causes cervical cancer in women. But mine over matter with you, Adrian, is that you just don't stop. Honey, you just don't stop. Well, let me just let you know that your sister... Miss Beloved Life, <laughs> while you on here making videos about edges, while you on here embarrassing yourself, intimidating yourself, showing dollar products, a dollar and 25 cent products from the dollar store, while you on here saying, you know, you're going to leave your braids in, your, your twisties in until tomorrow, until they dry, you are looking like a complete fool. Because your sister is not in the least bit worried about what you do, how you do it, when you do it. And then you made the statement and you told on yourself when you said, mm -mm, I don't give a F. You know, y'all might think that I'm talking about, yeah, y'all going to, I'm kind of paraphrasing it a little bit, but you guys get it. Y'all might think that I'm talking about my sister beloved life. Well, we ain't thinking we're not unsure. We are positively sure that you are speaking in reference to Miss B Love Life. And if you're and, and also you're speaking of my girl Wanda Whitley. I know you are. Because this is how wicked and naive that you are. Listen, honey, you're 50 years old. Shame yourself because you ain't shaming nobody else. You getting on here looking like a complete idiot. Talking about some damn edges. Who does that, Adrian? Who does that? Did you not feel stupid? Did you not feel intimidated by yourself of getting on here shaming yourself about some edges? That Listen, honey. Beloved has more things to do than to worry about some damn edges. I tell you over and over again, Beloved got enough money to get anything she want done to her hair, her body, or whatever. 
If she wants a hair implant, she can get that. But she didn't choose to do that. She chose to go the other way and get her hair the way she got it. But yet and still, you sat there and you didn't want nobody else to talk shizness about your sister when she revealed herself the real her, the real beloved life, the real Bethany Gasket. What she really looked looked it like behind the scene of all the makeup, the nails, the 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 the, uh, the eyelashes, and all of that stuff. She wanted to reveal her real heart. People made statements about her weight, and I made a statement about her weight as well because it was out of concern, compassion, and consideration. Okay. But she got on here and she revealed the real beloved life, just got tired of living behind that scene. And now she's being her. She's being real. You know what I mean? And she revealed the real beloved life, Bethany Gasket. But on the other hand, Adrian Slays, which is not a gasket because gasket is Mr. Nate's last name. Okay? On the other hand, Adrian Slays come in here and she wants to try to continuously just bring her sister down. But yet you sat there and you said, I ain't going to have nobody talking about my sister, but she my sister and I can do that. I can say that I can talk about her. What makes you any different? Because you her sister. Listen, honey, you never liked her before she became fortune and fame and a millionaire. When you claim that you met her when she was younger and she was a young, when she was younger, she was a cheerleader and it was your first time meeting her. You felt some way about her then because you seen within her that somewhere, somehow, someday she was going to be something unknown like you. You're nothing. All you do on here is get on here and you just shame yourself. You try to brainwash your cut-ups to believe this, that, that, and the other. When you come upon this camera, Adrian, you have to think and you have to try to sit there and study yourself to say, hey, what am I going to speak about today? Hey, what lie I'm going to bring up today? I got to bring up something on this camera. So then you choose to go in once, one more again and try to shame beloved life. Yes, people can be intimidated by her. Yes, people can become jealous of her. That's that's life. But my God, honey, you are really you are really trying to put her under the rug, drag her through the mud. Listen, it's not working for you. Everything has worked in Miss We Love Life favor. Because you know why? She's a she's a hard worker. She strives. She, she, I don't want to say she struggled. She strived for what she wanted. She strived for her success in what she wanted to build. She built her foundation. She's continuously building her foundation. So at the end of the day, like she said, she want to leave a legacy behind if anything should happen to her. <laughs> wow, Adrian. Adrian hands. When I do this, this is hands. You have absolutely nothing, absolutely nothing to offer. So you get on here and you shame yourself because you're not shaming her. Do you think that beloved looks at your videos? I'm sure you think that she looks at them. I'm sure that you want her to see those videos, don't you, Adrian? Yeah, you do. Stop lying. You know you want her to see them. And if she does look at them, she glimpses at them. And guess what she do? She sit there before that camera. That you're, that you're on, on your phone. And she sit there and she just say, Lord, I pray for my sister. I pray for her that you will give her shelter. That you will give her peace, prosperity, understanding, love, consideration, and compassion for herself. Because she know not what she do. Because you know that there's a mental illness issue there with her. So she know not what she do and she know not what she say. And she knows that when she comes on this camera and she speaks about me, she knows that someone somewhere somehow is going to look, seek, listen and find and hear it out. And they're going to view it. They're going to comment. They're going to either thumbs it up or thumbs it down. I thumbs it down. Because it's ridiculous how you come on this camera before this camera, Adrian Slays, and you make... This, what, what do they call it? Is it your commentary or your, what is it? I don't, I don't know. Um, wow. Wow. 
So your intro was to come in with four twisties here, four twisties there. Your commentary, am I saying it right, guys? Leave it down below. Is about beloved life again? Oh, oh what's wrong, honey? Um, listen, you ran out. Of, you have ran out of places to go. You have ran out of people to manipulate and use and violate. That's why I said that young lady, 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 you did a book bang mukbang in that car with her once again. Lady, you ain't get enough of her yet. Oh, baby. Mm. Uh, she already done manipulated and used people. And when they figured her out and found her out, they stepped right off from her. Okay. So. Sweetheart, you better run as fast as you can because listen, at the end of the day, she already intimidated and drug Lady down the road. I don't think Lady knew about it or know about it. You know what I mean? You got me down here in this drug infested neighborhood. Well, apparently you were there for a reason. Were you down there to cop Adrian? It's why you and Lady was down there. Were you down there to cop? But you try to make it seem like it was all on Lady. Mm. What were you looking for, Adrian? So, if you had any kind of common sense, sweetheart, you would run as fast as you can. Because I'm going to tell you, just like she's going to come for Lady, and she already did, and she she tried to you know intimidate her and said she has me in this drug infested area. That ain't all she going to do to Lady because Lady going to do something to strike her wrong. And then she's going to really put her out there on blast. Yum yums. You know, Anastasia Garadelli's world. I bring it to you pure and raw, uncut, unedited, 100%. So if you had any kind of sense, my dear, my darling, you would run as fast as you can. Because if you don't, at the end of the day, let me get a sip of this water. Mm -hmm. She's gonna come for you. Always remember, guys, that water is so water is amazing. Water is so amazing. It purifies your kidneys, your liver. It's it's good for your skin. You know what I mean? It keeps those kidneys functioning. It keeps those kidneys clean and pure and it detoxes your body. So always remember to drink water. I love water. I, at the end of the day, I have to have water. At the end of the day, I may drink at least five bottles of water. Not all in the, you know, not all in the same time. But in the course of the day, I drink five bottles of water. But let me tell you how I suffer the consequences at night when I get ready to lay down and go to bed. It don't bother me. But the moment I lay down, yum yums, ah, oh, baby, all hell breaks loose. Them kidneys start fleshing. They start fleshing. They start fleshing. But yeah, guys, so she wants to get on there. She wants to intimidate Miss Beloved Life so bad. She wants Beloved Life to look at that video so bad, honey. And Beloved Life might have looked at it. And just like I said, she probably sat there and said, Lord, help my sister. Help her. Lead her to take her medication because she needs it. Why is she so angry and has so much animosity towards me? Because <laughs> she's envious of you, Miss Beloved. She's jealous of you, Miss Beloved. You took away what she wanted in her life, Miss Beloved. As well, she thinks you took away what she wanted in her life. But not knowingly, knowing that she could have had the same success that you have. Not knowingly, knowing that she could have been rich like you were. But no, she, Adrian wants to come in and she wants to do explicit videos on Adrian Slave Variety, licking cucumbers and, and all that type of stuff and lollipops and drizzling honey, all that. That looks like that was porno. And they shut it down. But she tried to say, you had something to do with all that being done, beloved, or you or Mr. Nate or someone. No, absolutely not. Beloved and Mr. Nate had absolutely nothing to do with that. Adrian, you know how that channel got shut down because of your carelessness because of your carelessness but i'm here to say that 
your hair to Tori and you talking about some, you know, your yum yums telling, I mean, oh, whoa, 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 not my yum yum. Sorry, yum yums, my babies. Sorry. Your cut ups, what ups want you to do a hair uh, channel. Girl, you don't even know nothing about doing no damn hair. Because every time you get it done, you either come out with my blah, blah. You come out looking like uh, 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 queen, of, queen of, uh, 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 of, of the hookers. You come out looking like ain't no telling with yourself. Because ain't no telling about Lucille. Because Lucille, she, she ain't even on here no more. And I miss ain't no telling with Lucille. And I wouldn't even put you in the category with Lu ain't no telling with Lucille. Because Lucille, ain't no telling with Lucille. She fly as hell. But you, you're so messy. You're so messy. You're so so naive. You're just so vindictive. You're just so hatred. So much hatred and pain in your heart. What happened to you growing up as a kid that you have so much anger and hatred in your heart? Not only for beloved, but I guess some of the members of your family. You don't even speak about my girl Aunt Raynette anymore. Why don't you speak about Aunt Raynette no more? What have you done, Adrian? What have you done to my girl, my mom, your mother? I like her. What have you done to her? Uh. You see, you burn all your bridges any and everywhere you go. You cannot keep a friend longer than two weeks because you're too busy trying to seek, search, and find a place to lay your head. And each and every time you try to seek, search, and find a place to lay your head, I give it two days, three days, Maybe at the most a week. Bustier your ass right up out of there. What happened to the mystery man? Huh? Hey. Hey. The mystery man say, I deal with prostitutes hoes. I deal with prostitutes hoes. Mm. Was your coupanchi, your trussi, your trutra too wide as the Pacific Ocean for the mystery man? Or did he look down and say, hey! Oh, I see the mouth dropping oh, down below. Mm -hmm. What happened? Come on, tell us the story. Tell us the real deal. Tell us the dealio or what really happened to you and the mystery man. Because lead you to tell it. Like you said you left Jeffrey, the boat man. Lead you to tell it. You'll say that you left the mystery man. Mm -mm. The mystery man knew what you was and what you was about. He said, hey, you hasta la vista, baby. You got to go. Mm hmm. So don't come upon this camera talking about you going to open up a hair channel. You know absolutely nothing about doing hair. You're going to get on here and humiliate yourself to try to do a hair channel, Adrian. It never seems to amaze me. And all you're doing is just <laughs> absolutely making yourself look ridiculous. But guys, I had to come in yum yums, yum yums. I apologize when I almost said my yum yums. I know my yum yums ain't over there with with them 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 uh uh uh, uh what you what up cut up what up my my apologies my yum yums because I love my yum yums. All right, so guys, if you should understand this video, like this video, please like, comment, share this video with anyone, everyone, everywhere, all over the world. And if you like, you can tag this to Miss Beloved Life for me. I don't do tagging because I'm not too good and all of that stuff. And now and I ain't dumb now. And I ain't illiterate, but I'm just saying I don't know how to do all that tagging. So if you should like this video, please thumbs this video up. Reach over there, hit that notification bell so that you, 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 and you could be notified of all of Anastasia Gerardelli's world videos. Push all, guys. So each and every time I upload, you will see that video. All right? Stay positive. Stay blessed. Have an amazing, prospered weekend. It's dreary. It's raining. The rain has stopped. Um, hopefully, I hope that the sun comes out because it's a dreary day. You know what I mean? And I don't like dreary days because it makes me think. About my son, you know, I go into a depression about my son and um, I just keep praying on it and just saying, Lord, you know, I, I miss him so much. I miss him so much, guys. Yum yums. I miss him so much. You guys, I, I just don't you don't even know. You don't even realize the the pain, the intensity, the pain that my body is is having missing my son. I miss him tremendously, tremendously. 
But on that note, guys, have an amazing, wonderful, prospered weekend. Always remember to put God first and foremost in your life because he is the importance. That alarm clock did not wake you up this morning. Our Heavenly Father woke us up this morning. So what you need to do is give all thanks and glory to God and say, Lord, I thank you for allowing me to see another day. Have an amazing day, guys. Stay positive. Stay blessed. Keep the peace. Stay out of trouble and let no hurt, harm, or danger come against you. This is Anastasia Garadelli's World coming into you this afternoon on a Friday, misty, rainy day, telling my yum yums that I love you guys so much. And please share this video and watch this video from beginning to end. This is part three of the Adrian Slay supposedly want to do a hair tutorial. You guys know she ain't going to work that out, honey. She don't even know how to do hair. But what she need to do, instead of twisting that damn hair, she need to dye that damn hair. Because that hair grayer than them dogs, ping, ping. And she got so much damn gray heads, honey. Uh, mm. Okay. I love you guys. I'll talk to you later. Bye, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. Let me move this plate. Let me move this because I have stuff on the table. And so you guys will see things on the table. I have to turn my camera around. I love you guys. Bye.